So we're here at the Chagas Education Stand with here with Marcella Phelan. So Marcella, in terms of education, how can farmers go about doing the Green Cert? Okay, um, there's a wide range of opportunities to do your Green Cert course within Chagas. You can do a full-time course for anyone that's doing their Leaving Cert or in secondary school. You can do a part-time course for anyone that's over 23 and may not have any education qualifications. Or you can do the distance course um, where you have a non-agriculture level 6 major award and you can do a distance course. Each of them are very have different durations but once you complete the, all those three courses you will get the Green Cert. And have, is there anything new happening this year in terms of uh, education with Chagas? Yeah. Um, within education in Chagas there's probably two new areas at the moment. We are developing five apprenticeship programmes. Four of them have been submitted to QQI for validation and the industrial training legislation has been approved. The four of them would be two farm based ones, a horticulture one and a sports turf one. The equine one would be developed before the end of the year and submitted to QQI. And the other major um, investment in Chagas, which is funded by the Department of Agriculture, is our simulators. So nationally we have been approved for 18 simulators. We have a demo one in the main tent. So we're here with the farming simulator with Francis Quigley at the, at the ploughing. So Francis, I suppose, what is the farming simulator and how can it help students? I suppose one of the big advantages of the farming simulator is that it can uh, help with inexperienced uh, drivers. It allows them the opportunity to practice in a safe environment, uh, uh, you know, not having the nervousness of driving a big tractor out in the yard. Once they've uh, safely progressed um, on the course here, then they can move out onto the real tractors and get the full experience out in the yard. And what other types of machines can they practice on this? Uh, uh, the range of agricultural machines, so we have the tractor, the loader, there's a range of attachments for the back of it, including as you see here the trailer, uh, but then there's also an agricultural telescopic loader and a uh, combine and an excavator. Very good, thanks very much Francis. So Marcella, just if people wanted to know more about doing the Green Cert, how could they find out, find out more information? Okay, if they come to the ploughing, they can meet us outside with the, at the education stand or inside here at the simulator. They can visit our website www.chagas.ie for slash education or they can attend any of our open days in the colleges which start in, in October as well. We have a QR card um, lined up, so if you click on this it will bring you directly to um, our website as well in Chagas. Very good, thanks very much.